Hey guys, we have a new subscription box for my channel and I'm really excited about it. Welcome or welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Andy and I'm really happy that you're here. You guys, I have subscribed to the Slay Glam Box. Everyone that, everyone that gets it loves it. And I saw some really great things that I liked. So I thought, why not? Luxley's going away. Uh, Luxley, I will have my unboxing for November, um, but then they have stopped doing unboxing. So that's gone. I canceled my So Susan. I still have three more months because it did renew, um, but just, just to try other things. So this is the, this is the sleigh, the sleigh glam box. You guys, I think this is the October box. I'm pretty sure. It is the October box. It could be November, but I'm pretty sure it's October. I don't know. I haven't seen, I haven't watched any of the October boxes because uh, I, I didn't want to see what was in it. So let's just go ahead and, and go through this. So we have an ultra fine eyeliner from Italia, Italia, Italia Deluxe. Okay. And it's in the shade gold. And it is a pencil. Oh, that's a pretty gold. That's pretty gold. I like it. I like it. And then we have this lighting crew. Tiny writing is what we have. The beauty crop lighting crew nourished with pineapple and green tea. Oh, it is a highlighting cream. Okay. There's that. I'm not going to open that. I'm not going to open it. I have a ton of cream. Okay. I will open it. Oh, all right. Never mind. I just put too much on my hand, but it is a really pretty rose gold. That is way too much. I understand that guys. That's really pretty. That's really pretty. I wasn't going to open it because I've gotten so many cream and liquid highlighters from So Susan. Um, but it's really pretty. Okay. Now we have Bella Pierre Cosmetics Lip Gloss Quad. Great as lipstick toppers. So I think this is holographic. Now, I think I have this one. So let me look. Stand by. I do have it. It's right here. I think it's the same. Yeah, it's the same. So let's swatch that. I'm not going to swatch these other ones because I don't know if I'm going to keep them or not. Oh, that's really pretty, though. Let's do it on a different hand because I don't know how much of that is the highlighter and how much is the actual lippy. Because I'm a mess. Okay, that is really pretty. And that would be pretty on some really dark lipstick. So, I don't know if I'm going to keep them or not, but I love the idea of them. And I, of all the lip glosses I have, I don't have anything like this. So I may end up keeping this. I may. And then we have this Beauty Crop Vita Glow. It is a set. And it has a, looks like a bronzer. I don't know. Let me get in it. Looks like a bronzer, a setting powder, and a little palette. And those are really fun fall shades. The shimmers are really pretty. Um, I'm probably not keeping this because I do have quite a few. Um, but this bronzer is gorgeous. Isn't that bronzer pretty? Yeah, I like that. I like it. I'm going to keep that. I don't really have very many bronzers at all. And then a setting spray. Vitamin Bake setting spray. Ew. I think this leaked a little bit. I think it did. Just a little bit. Wipe it off real quick. 
Yeah, it did. It did leak a lot, actually. So, it looks like it leaked some. Uh, this, this, the mister seems nice. Uh, I am definitely keeping this because I will always keep setting sprays. Um, I use them for my brushes or for like shimmers and stuff, but I also use them to set my face. Uh, so I will definitely keep that. So, so far, the only thing I'm definitely not keeping is this little palette. And that's fine because I know someone would love to have that and I will put that in a giveaway. Now this is a palette, um, Rasha B Cosmetics, which I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, I believe she is the curator of these boxes. She's the owner of the company and these are her palettes, um, which I think is awesome. Uh, it is the Bonfire Eyeshadow Palette. Yeah, that's really cute. I had never heard of her, of this brand before. I was watching Jennifer Loves Makeup talk about her uh, monthly makeup that she had used. And she used another palette that she got in this box. And I think that's what she said, is that it's Rasha B. Um, oh, that's, that's really kind of pretty. Unique color story, for sure. But this... Looks like a duochrome or even a multi-chrome. Let's swatch. Want to? Let's swatch these because I, I want to know. Okay, so that is, there's no, there's no names. It's just that green. Okay, that's not very pigmented. This is an orange. Uh, kind of feels like a shimmer. Wow, that's really pigmented. So that was the green, and now we're going to do this blue right here. Blue, silvery. Feels nice. That's really nice. And now, so we just did that. We're going to do this brown. Oh, that feels nice. That's a matte. That's very nicely pigmented. Very nicely pigmented. I don't, I can't tell what those, that orange and this yellow is, looks like it's the same thing as far as formula wise. And it's not real smooth, but it's not, oh my goodness. Look at that. That is a shimmer. That is that one right there. Now we're going to do this one that I think that I'm pretty sure is a duochrome. Look at that. That is freaking gorgeous. And look, there's nothing left on my finger except for just a little bit of shimmer. That is nice. I like that. I liked the other shades, but holy cow. Okay, let's finish. Let's finish it up strong. We're going to finish up strong. Okay, now is this, it looks kind of like a dark teal. <gasps> it's soft. Dark teal, emer emerald green. Um, This is a gold, this gold right here. Oh, look at that. And then we're going to finish off with this purple. You guys. That's crazy. I have never heard of this before. Those That duochrome right there is insane. This gold, this silver, the mattes are really nice. Um, this and this were, 
kind of like a shimmer, but it's different. It feels really different. Okay, I'm going to do something. I'm going to take that yellow and that orange. Okay, they definitely have some shimmer to them. They are pigmented. Those are gorgeous. Those are gorgeous, you guys. What is that all over me? Is that silver? What is that? Did I get something on me? Oh, I bet it was flaking off. It looks like it was kind of flaking off. Okay, so I think we'll probably need some glitter glue with those because this shade and this shade were flaking off of my arm. You guys, those are pigmented. All right, then. Uh, I'm pleasantly surprised. Pleasantly, pleasantly surprised with that palette. Uh, we'll see how, we'll see how the formula is on the skin um, at some point, but all right, then. I'm I'm really impressed. That was really beautiful. That those were really beautiful. When I first saw it, I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw it, I was like, okay, that's nice. That's a pretty color story, not my personal color story. But I will use that. I will. Okay, well, my first experience with the Slag Land box is very favorable. Very favorable favorable experience. I'm probably gonna keep these. Because I don't have toppers like that. I've been using eyeshadow as toppers. Shimmer eyeshadow. I'm gonna keep this bronzer. What is what is on what is on my hand? Okay, you guys, sorry. I'm a freaking disaster, evidently. Uh, I am gonna keep this bronzer. Uh, I'm gonna keep the eyeliner. I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep everything except for this. And I'm sure it's beauty crop. I'm sure it's really nice, but I don't really want it. Like, I don't, uh, I have very warm shades in other palettes, and those kind of shades are really not, these three here are really not my deal, uh, and I already have them, so if I need them, I have someplace else, but the shimmers look beautiful, and these two shades right here are gorgeous. Yeah, so that's nice. My first experience is very favorable. I'm very happy, very happy with this box. Yeah, all right. You guys tell me in the comments below, do you get this box? What are your, what are your, um, opinions, your comments, your feelings on this box? I would like to know. Um, but thanks so much for joining me while I open my very first month of the Slag Land box on. I'm looking forward to more. I really am. I really appreciate being here. And until our next adventure, everyone have a great day and we'll see you later.